Hello everyone, today we're going to be creating a skateboard. Well, you should know how this looks like, but just in case you don't know how it looks like, it looks like this. So, let's do this. The first step is to bring out a round roof. Let's zoom in. And let's turn this 90 degrees. Up to zero. Now let's bring in a box and place it right there. There needs to be no space, so let's just check. Let's just align this. Now we duplicate the shape and move it to the other side. Now we'll just group these shapes to get like a, you know, skateboardish types shape. Now we'll just bring in a box over here. We'll bring, make it smaller till about five. We'll turn it 20 or negative 22.5 and place it on here. Bring it up till zero. Just for better like seeing, let's just ungroup this and just make this white there. So let's um, align everything. Yep, and now it's there. Let's move it right about here. Yep, good enough. And let's take another box move it down to five and just bring it here and just align everything yeah now take the the shorter shape and move it to align the big box now take it and just move it so there's no space like that now we take duplicate the shape and move it to the other side. Make it till five for faster movement and just change it back. Now we mirror the shape this way and we'll just move it to the correct area. About there is right and select the smaller shape and just move it here yep that's correct now take take all the three shapes one one two three and we'll group now we'll duplicate this we'll move up Yep, like this is good enough. And now we'll just make these holes and try and move this down. Oh. Take all of these three and move down. Why is that not selected? Oh. Yep, like that. can take this as well oh, okay so we can take these two shapes just move up like this and now we can group to make it look better we can just bring in another box we'll make it smaller like this yep we'll move it to the other side make it a hole like this 
and will do. Not everything seems even. Now, let's, as we can see, it's way too thick. We'll make it thinner to about there. And it's way too high. So we'll bring it down like this. Yeah. Now, let's, oh, uh, we could make it a bit shorter, this, yeah, now, now let's group it much better. So, to make the, the black, like, grip part on the top, we'll just need to duplicate the shape, bring it up a little, and make it black. It might look glitchy right now, but let's take this shape. As we can see, it's 12.83, so let's make it like 12.5. And now just align. But for the end, it's a bit off, so let's take this. Oh. Let's, let's zoom in a bit. Yeah, let's take this and make it 39.9. Yeah, and just align this. Wait, what just happened? Bruh. 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 So let's make this black 39.8. Now we can align this and it looks like this. So let's make this um, like the color of wood. And now let's work on the wheels. This is going to be the hard part. So the first step is to bring out a um, cylinder makes the sides as 64 add bevel about this much and add segments all the way to get this smooth edge so now we'll take this move it down till the very end make it bigger using shift and up and just bring it down there now group and put it down to zero. Now let's bring in a torus. What do you call that? I don't know. And we'll just put it in here. Now we'll, we'll make the tube as one. Yep. We'll make it a bit thicker. Duplicate, move up, duplicate, and duplicate. Yep, like this. Now let's just align everything. Let's take all the blue shapes. Oops. And four. Make it a bit bigger. Yeah, and this is good. You can make it smaller and just a bit taller. Okay, now let's bring in this, a roof. And we'll just turn it 90 degrees. Oh, my bad. We'll just turn this 180. We'll just place it in there. Let's make this smaller to about here. the size and lift. Oh, it's in the floor, so let's bring this up to zero and we'll just bring this down to about here. Now let's bring in a cylinder make this longer, add sides, and turn it, we'll 
just add this. Now we'll duplicate and move it to the other side. Make it one so for faster movement. Now we'll mirror it. Make this a hole. Let's make this a hole as well. And just put it like the other. Now we'll just group these two shapes. And with these three shapes, we can do that alignment. Now we can group to get this. Now let's put some color into this. So let's make this light gray from up. Take these four blue shapes and make them dark gray. And make this black. Now select only the cylinder shapes and group. Multicolor. Now let's add a cylinder. Let's turn this around 90 degrees. Add sides of 64. Make this small. That's way too big. Nine is good. Let's make this longer. Yep, like this. And now let's make the wheels. So add the cylinder, make the sides as 64, add the most bevel and add the most segments. So we get this smooth wheel, like skateboard wheel type of thing. That will make it like about this height, we'll duplicate the shape, we'll make it shorter, we'll bring it up, we're using shift and down, we'll make it smaller, yep, like this, let's make it a hole, make it a bit smaller, okay, let's make this 0 0.1. Yep, now we take these two shapes, we can group to get a wheel shape. Let's make this white and let's make this black. Almost done, almost done. Now let's turn this 90, ne negative 90 degrees. Let's move this skateboard out of the way. And we'll duplicate this and move it to the other side. Now we'll take this, we'll mirror it this way, yep, and now let's align everything. Let's take everything and we'll click this middle button here, right, and, and we'll make the wheels a bit bigger. So if this is 20, and we make it 26, 26, so what was this, 26.09, so we'll make this 26.09, yep, now we'll Select these two shapes again, or everything, sorry, my bad. And we'll align like this. We take these three shapes, then we'll um, align like this. Seems like it's in the middle. And now, um, let's make this a bit bigger and a bit longer from the bottom. Let's make this go through. Yep, like this, perfect. And now, let's group all of this. Yep. Now, let's turn this 
180 degrees make it way smaller let's bring this up to zero let's bring in the skateboard Oops. and we'll just keep making this smaller until it's the right size this it's small. Maybe this is right. Yep, I think so. Let's attach this here. Maybe turn it here. We'll duplicate the shape and we'll move it to the other side. Let's make it one for faster movement. And now let's mirror it. shape move it in a bit now let's take these two shapes we'll group we'll take these two shapes we'll group make it multicolored and now for the final step we'll align everything Now we have officially finished a skateboard on Tinkercad. So let's move to zero and we have finished a skateboard on Tinkercad. Thank you for watching.